Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Marmoset. Set. We're back with Endless Legends. We need to put a settler here. We're waiting on that. The other thing we're waiting on doing is we have an army over here. Heading for this. We've made them a ghost force, so they can't be seen unless someone stood right next to them. So our intent is to take advantage of that. You are very determined to be lurking around here in my way, aren't you? Oh, I just remembered. We gave one of our units... Turn you off, pick that up. You've closed your borders. I would like you to come over to here. Look at that beautiful movement you've got. Alright. Now here's a question can I search that ruin from here? I can. That was sneaky. Can I walk into your territory? I can. Hopefully, because you burnt that down, it doesn't count as you being able to see me. We'll find out soon enough. You. We we're also heading over here. Just have these guys sweep up the pearls. And Twelve turns until... the Roman army. You're heading home. Twelve turns until the next winter, so we're trying to grab as many of these pearls as we possibly can. Is there anything else we wouldn't mind getting? City improvements? Better watchtowers. Army faction can spend to spells to shift form. Stockpiles. Muty to win division penalties. Armor pearls. No, I'm happy with that. Tear four prayers. Do I want to not have that? Maybe. I think I'm okay with it for now. And you've built me the apprentice registry and now you're working on the lumber mill. It means you get you in three turns, you're gonna complete immediately. And you build me a couple more a couple of monks. And here's the question. Oh, are you gonna spot me as I do my raid? Movable force? Glorious father. Empire approval. Did the first have an empire approval? of 100 in order to gain the effect. Double dust. So currently we've got 94 out of 100. And the Elder Rower, the Throne of Emperors, we're not going to be building that anytime soon. So which of our cities is not perfectly happy? You're just happy, you're fervent, and you're 95%. Alright. Well, Glory of Empire doesn't prove happiness. Remember, we need to get things leveled up all the way to 4 to get them to improve a lot. Central Market, a couple turns, will boot that one up. Two turns for a Settler. Plenty of production to be getting on with. So, let's cycle around our units. Yes, do Beach and grab me that. Do pop over there and grab me that. You still got movement? You do. You'd be so kind as to come over there. You can get to there but you know you're out of movement. You've got three more points so spend them going further north. We are a more expansionist faction. We have plenty of space so you go over to here. And then we come up to there. And then we will talk to this. There we go. So we've earned the Wolf Bane of the Shepherd, which is a very particular nice star. To show it, equip it a hero and show it and return to Jodas in glory. So we get a blood crystal and pacification. Okay. So we're gonna search that rune anyway to pick up some pearls. Don't particularly think feel the need to piss these people off any more than we have to, but let's just pop that over here. Since we are a ghost force, and we're going to take advantage of it. Search that. Find nothing of any interest. Fine. You need to come home. About six one half dozen the other, really, isn't it? So it's no notion you're telling me that it's quicker to go that way. But I know there are armies that way, and I don't particularly want to pick a fight with it. So we'll go this way. 
can have not winter for 11 turns. Lumber mill for settler, canal system for Navy of Anomalies, thank you very much. You're heading into there. And I will have you join the garrison. Take that turn. Failed to complete a princely test. Yep, that's fine by me. You... You have declared war. Oh, that is unfortunate. Hmm. You completed that. Up to luxury alchemist. So who is it we are exactly at war with? It is red. And that city is pretty weak. Looks like we'll be going back this way then. Don't wish to lay a siege. Oh, so just talk to them. Get me 20 XP, go there, and then come across. Move a little bit further. So, how much cash have we got? 1300 or so. Is that enough to buy a monk? Yes, it is. Right, click to end the turn. We have a Skyfin. Head up to there. You grab that. You've still got some movement points, so pick up those pearls. And then pick up those. You've picked up them successfully, and we're out of pearls in this area. Alright, so you have the ability to suck up resources. So what are these? Die deposit is a little bit of happiness and influence. You like produce science, which is also very useful. Titanium. What's the symbol for spices? Ah, it's the diamond one, isn't it? Not much in the way of any use out here. Uh, you're out of move. You've got three left. A little bit of happiness, more influence, more science, and more happiness. Now go park yourself on that, and gather me some more moon leaf. What does this do? More cash? A lot of happiness, yep. 98% on that one. So you're up to your fervent, your 90, your 100. Produce a monk and a unit. So we're basically just trying to get those guys down to here, because that's going to be the front line. Let's pop that dredge out and bring you down to here. It'll take you a while, but I'd rather have you down there than elsewhere. Pretty sure the enemy are in this location. So. Yeah, legendary deed completed. That's interesting to see. Brilliant world well leadership. 100, so we are a benevolent emperor, so plus 100% cash, so that's really going to help. Um, I really didn't want to get into a fight with you. Um, it's entirely in our benefit to do it, though, so I would rather take the fight, get the experience points, and retreat. Found me again. Right. Apparently we're dealing this one first. We've got a lot of space, so um, let us put that unit as far south as we can go. Ready? Run down here and stay on hold position. So, sorry about this one, ladies and gentlemen. This is basically me going to be flipping around again. We exploit the fact that these guys have truly awful movement. As we have a move speed of 5. You will now try and go that way. I will now run over there. Yes, yes, I know. You, uh, you're going to struggle to catch me. Mind you being flying. So that I can fly. 
turn four. We'll then try and move a little bit closer. I will scarf that down here. You will then try and move a little bit closer. I will scarf her over there. Your awful movement speed means you can't catch me. That will be the end of this fight, and then I can get this guy somewhere else. Dismiss. Yes, I didn't earn a thing. That's fine. Alright. Grab that pearl. And then... Alright, well you're sitting on the moon leaf. So I wouldn't also mind some more moon leaf. Is there a resource behind there? No, it's just wetland. Hmm, wetland. And you give... An attack bonus, that's not that useful. I wouldn't mind getting some more adamantium earlier on. More wine, more wine, more moon leaf. Uh, yeah, let's uh, get some more of that. And if these guys decide to come down, we'll just run exactly the same game with this one. So, that's you coming down to here. Population of these two places has grown. Our hero is leveled up. Uh, what's this one do? Attack on units. Train with anomalies. No anomalies in this area. Plus 15% on city. Expansion approval on city. Well, we're going to grab that one and then go up to that one. Apply those changes. I also want to inspect you. Go to equipment. Because I believe we picked up a quest item. And we have the titanium. So we'll take that. So your current one. Significant boost to attack and damage. Nice. And since you are going to be actually wandering around in the field. We will give you that one. We will spend the cash. And give you ghost force. Retaliation boost. Or affinity. Ice Walker. What's Retaliation Deflector? Yeah, you're never going to be in a position where you're going to get smacked in the face. Ice Walker. Uh, better moving in winters. We'll all get Affinity. More curls, more XP for pearls. More damage when you do Retaliation. Yeah, let's take that. Smiths, it's fine with me. So we have a monk and a settler. I will deploy you. You as a new army. We'll go over here. You as a new army. We'll head for the city. You're out of move. These things have been constructed. It's good to see. And now we have another fight to deal with. Okay, um, can we get a flatter deployment? Yes, we can. Ready? Uh, focus your fire on the first of the Minotaurs. Nudge it over so I can see. And you're on that one, and you're on that one. Go. We are infantry slayers, not cavalry slayers, and these guys are cavalry. However, we're doing a fair chunk of damage. So I think we... overall it's a balancing act. Running away versus just engaging these guys. I think we will take less damage. Better killed him thanks to the power of our uh, hero. We will take less damage from engaging these guys than we will from running away. See? None. Engage, 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 engage. <laughs> Scuttle, scuttle, scuttle. We picked the wrong bat people to pick a fight with. Nice, because we're in the uh, summer period. He healed everyone at the start of his turn. He'll go stand there. 
unfortunately, which means he actually takes an action. So overall, our damage was very minimal. We cleared those out from experience points. We are going to select our ghost unit. We'll wander along just a little bit further. You can have your war if you want to. We got what we wanted. So we're there. So we need to head back to that location with that staff. So we will do that by sending those dredge up to here. Then assign the hero to that unit. And then send them back again. So our Empire plan needs revising. Um, we've got a thousand influence points, we can get plus three movement, we can get the extra reduction on costs, we don't necessarily, um, not building units right now, the attack, we're good for cash. We afford that one, yeah, plus two thing on a district, don't necessarily think we need it right now, I am happy with that. Reapply our plan. We have a fight. Settlers been caught by ice wolves. Retreat. Ah, but you are, however, right next to our goal. So we can get that complete. Army that contains a settler unit. We earned 13 pools. A trap! Avoid them for four turns. Cannot retreat. Alright, well we'll just auto this one. And we lost. So we'll see what not that what that happens actually. I mean that was a lost settler, which is sad to see. Shooting intensifier in our armor, good. You're building another Garth. I do actually do want another settler. Oh, I'm probably after the fish farm, because we will be Uh, so the market we don't necessarily need, so I will cancel that. Oh, yeah, it does give us a bit more things. Benevolent Emperor. City focus. Alright. So we can build now all of them? It is indeed. So we will do. That will tick in eventually. Um, we are going to be wanting to build another army up. Um, at some point to work with our mage, but in the interim, you are heading that way. Please do so. You are a monk, you're heading there to join up with that army. I do want the monk earlier more than else since we are at war. And I want the settler. Then everything else will tick in bit by bit. You are absurdly happy. So we'll leave the market down there. Bump that up. Cancel the watchtowers. And leave that be. You're growing in four turns. You're not got that much to build. And we'll have that before the glory of the empire. Just switch that way up just a little bit to save a bit of time off. And you've got plenty to go be getting on with. Um, yes, I would like the roads, because that will improve trade as well. You are heading down to work on that for me. You are reasonably happy that you're okay. Don't quite have enough moon leaf to activate it yet, that's fine by me. And you two need to merge into one army. Hold of that position if you would, please. Researched a new era. So a load of resources have been revealed. And we've got this one. Plus 3% to time. Our research queue is now empty. So, apparently, 
we didn't necessarily discover any of the extra minerals. There's a green one out there. Well, the great thing about the sky fins, we can just send people out to get them. Uh, and the purple one ended up down there. But nothing new in here. You get nothing new in any of them. There's a purple one over there. I am tempted to just obliterate you and then burn all your cities. Just to make life a little easier for myself. But I would need two armies to do that, because I'm pretty sure you've got them. So right of way is built. Which means we now have some trade routes generating some science. Which is nice. We won't get any more really till we get some docks. Lock yourself there. Sign a hero. You select. Parlay. Complete the quest. Pacification and 25 blood crystals. Incredible! All the Jotas have now been pacified. Nice. You. Uh, just come down here. And then in five turns we'll reassign you to the city. Straight away I got something that requires a lot of turns. We'll build a fish farm in one. Might as well do that. That will greatly improve the growth rate. Why am I juggling this? Because I essentially just want to make sure that our hero is getting the credit for each of these buildings. But I want the settler first and foremost. Grab that. Get the improved food up. No. Need it after that. And then I do want the monk after the fish farm. Done. Alright, I'll make a fair bit of cash. Just need to, you to finish off some blooming buildings so we can actually get our second army up and running. Speaking of which, yep, you just look. And that'll be that episode. So we've been, war has been declared. Not much else has happened. Um, we've discovered some more resources that we might quite like the look of. Um, we'll be sending our units out to go, our skyfins out to go and grab some of them. Something we might add. You've got a bit full queue. Your queue is nice and empty. Um, would you be so kind as to grab me a couple of skyfins, please? It'll take you an absolute age to get on them. Um, next time that grows, I am going to switch you to a... Ooh, no research. Right, so let's pick that, and we will finish this episode. Peace, yeah. Our chemical armor will venture it in. So we're over here. Now we've got the... Yep, we've got both of those available to us, and I've seen symbols for those. So we'll grab those two extractors. That is the cargo docks, which we will want for improved trade. I do want those two sciences. You are food, which I will want. Trade routes, also good. And I will probably take those armor units. You are defensive structures. Yes, I will want dust. Yes, I will want dust. And yes, I will want that one. Um, in fact, I will probably want that one first. So, one, 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 one. So you're now first. So in four turns, we will get twenty a cinema reduction to our approvals. Which will help nicely. All right. Thank you very much for watching, gentlemen. I've been the Marvel set. This has been Endless Legends. War. What is it good for? The moment. Very little. Hope maybe we'll find out later on. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Particularly if you have any tips on what you'd like me to do to whether or not fight a defensive war or take it to them. Defensively, we would require us to do very little and just sit where we are. Offensively, we would probably have to build up another army, which might take a while because everyone's busy building things. Oh. Bye for now.